As you can see in the background here, for years, the residents, for over 20 years, the residents have been clamoring for a new bridge in this area. It was dilapidated. When the old bridge was here, they had over two feet of water coming over the bridge. And with the interjection of the community, the residents here, they, they came and through the Rural Development Company. And as you all know, we are stressing right now on local government reform where the community will be involved in which projects they want and the contractors will come from within the community. So the bridge took about five months to be completed and it is completed. The contractor did a very good job and I must compliment them. The residents are satisfied, the councillor for the area, the member of parliament. And we continue to go around the country to help rural communities because we are the Ministry of Rural Development and Local Government. That this construction would lead to a betterment for the community in terms of the flow of the water to other areas. When it comes to serving the people, there's no politics. There's no PNM, there's no UNC. There's the people and we are elected to support the delivery of service to the people. I commend this bridge and I will give credit to the minister. As the execution agency, um, RDC has been trying its best to accommodate the government of Trinidad and Tobago in all these projects. Uh, basically, none of our projects so far, particularly this one in particular, this, all these projects that we have done have been done within cost. So there have no, been no overruns on none of our projects. 